What's up, everybody? Thank you so much for joining me. It's been a while. It's been a while, right? Craziness. Work has been absolutely nuts. I've been pretty busy for the most part, man. Pretty busy for the most part. <laughs> it's crazy, you know, because sometimes you wake up and you're kind of like, here we go again, man. Like, fuck. You know? Right before you leave in the morning, just say one thing for me, man. Good day. And walk out, man. It'll change everything. It'll change your whole perspective on shit. I'm stoked today. Super stoked. We're going to tell a little story before we get into this. You read the title. You know what it is. I have my favorite in here. Right in here, like always. We're going to talk about a few of the standouts to me. However... These are by far, it's so hard, we're going to get into all this. Story time. So, Vape Summit. Vape Summit was a while ago. I went to it. I was very excited to meet a few of the people, definitely a few of the people that have supported, you know, what I've done and what I've been doing. Uh, meet them face to face, man. It was really cool. And I got to hang out with Nick and the whole Humble Wick and Wire crew. Nick, what's up, man? Um, Melinda, oh, great wire, fantastic wire. That was really fun to build with. Excellent, supreme cotton, man. Uh, anyway, anyway, anyway. So we're at Vape Summit. Uh, I'm meeting people. It's crazy, and and I'm looking for Todd. Todd Toller from CA Vapes. One of my favorite people. He's a super nice guy. Super nice guy. He he was the one that came out of nowhere during the uh, Mink Machine uh, review, we were just kind of talking about the showcase. We're just showing off his products, what he makes. And talking about nowhere, donated a Vulcan to give away. It was so cool, man. So cool. Uh, so I'm looking for this guy. Yeah, you know, babe. And I'm looking for this guy. So I'm like, all right. Find Todd. Todd, where are you? Todd and Ray. <laughs> and Matt. Vanessa, okay, it goes on and on and on. We'll do a vlog or something. I want to talk about this whole the whole trip there. And it's way old, but to me, like it was like it was yesterday. It was so fun. So I finally find Todd. And I walk up and he's just larger than life. Big dude. Big dude. And he and and I shook his hand and, and it was like it was a it was a pretty cool moment for me. For me, you know what I mean? And I shook his hand. I said, what's up? What's up? And, and out of my, my left eye, this dude's just, just stoked. He's right here, and he's just stoked. And I can, I can feel his vibes, you know? And I'm tripping out, dude, because this dude's just fucking, what's up, dude? You, you know, you can just tell he's amped to be there, just, just to be there at that moment. And it was crazy. So anyway, you know, I'm looking at a couple things. And Dean reaches out. This will be the first shoot we're talking about. And hands me this. Nectricus. Alright. Hands me this. I believe you that it was a clear when I tried it. Yeah, it was a clear. Okay, okay, okay. It was a mod and it had juice in it. And I grabbed it. And I vaped it. And I was blown away. It's been a very long time. Since the Newt Juice has literally knocked me on my ass. And it was like, did that just happen? You know what I mean? Like, uh, you know, I'm pretty sure we're all at a certain point right now. Where you get a juice, you can kind of, you know, whether it be a strawberry or a strawberry kiwi or whatever it may be. And you're kind of, you know what to expect. You kind of, you kind of get the idea, right? Maybe you're stuck in this rut. And, and I was at the time. It was kind of like, you know, everything's okay, you know, everything's good, and, and, and everything's working great. And then I tried Nectricus. Blew me out of the water, and I, and I looked at him, and I was, and I remember it was like a moment, I was just like, <laughs> like, are you for real, dude? Like, so much flavor, and, and it was very crazy, weird mouthfeel, and I walked away. 
you know, he's like, oh, it's great to meet you, man. It was actually more great for me to meet him, you know. And, and I shook his hand, and I was stoked. So I go back to the booth, and, you know, we're building away, and Melinda's chilling with me. And I says, Melinda, you got to try this jizz, you know, like, you got to try this. And I, she drips it, and she just, she takes a hit, and she just looks at me. She's just like, where? Where did you get it? <laughs> and, you know, I took her. And she's like, I'm going to give him the pouty face, you know. <laughs> so... You know, whatever. we go back over to the booth, and we're chilling, we're standing there, and she's just giving him the look. And then she holds up the bottle or something. I think she's on the, she's like, me. <laughs> so she, you know, he hooks her up with a bottle of nectar, because that's how it started, man. You know, and I've been very, very fortunate enough, very, very fortunate to have tried not only everything in his line, but a couple of extras that aren't available. Okay. So it's it's it, it, you can see I'm kind of at a loss for words. I really don't know how to go about this review. But I will tell you without a doubt, without a single doubt in my mind that this is one of the best well-rounded e-liquid lines I have ever had. Ever. Ever. No doubt about it. They got this savory. Uh, and there's, you know, there's there's everything from sweet to savory, but, but his savory vapes are just crazy. I got one here that I haven't tried yet, and I've been wanting to try, and I thought we'd try it live today. And it's Candy Shop. I believe it's like a candy menthol, right? So he, he's got a very light hand with these very heavy dense flavors and, and it's very difficult to do it's very difficult to do um, let's get into it man nectar kiss all right it's a nectarine custard now every every one of his juices I'm not getting any gunking out of these which tells me a few things he's using high quality vegetable glycerin propylene glycol um, you know, his high, high quality flavorings, uh, no added sweeteners. Um, I really don't know how he does it. Uh, I believe it's a 70, 30. I don't know if it's all of them. I know sweet pea is, but nectar kiss, I believe. But as you can see, it's, it's, it's not the thinnest, but it's, it's fairly on the thin side, but it's, I believe, I believe for the most part it's 70, 30 all around. Uh, I didn't quite ask, you know what I mean? Um, Nectarine custard, it, and you basically get this almost earthy tones underneath this nectarine, but this nectarine tastes so realistic. It's so good, man. Like my mouth's watering just thinking about it. Like it's taken me a lot because of what I'm vaping now, and I have the empty one, which I'm gonna try candy shop in, but I want to drip that in that right now. Um, it's it's definitely an e-liquid I crave. I crave a lot. I've gone through probably 530s, easy, easy, and, and it was no problem at all, no problem, like I didn't get sick of it, you know what I mean? Pretty much everything I vaped to his, for the most part, I'm trying to think, I've enjoyed, I've ran right through, even flavors I didn't think I would like, um, something like Grasshopper, which is very palate cleansing, it's it's a winter green, uh, it's, it's very palate cleansing, it's is it here? And I'm on his site right now. Oh, looks like there's some other reviews on here. At coilvapes.com. Of course, all the links will be in the description. Okay. If, if you're looking for... Let's say you're like me. Right? Sometimes maybe you get in a rut. And maybe you've never tried a savory flavor. I highly, highly urge you to try this line, man. I highly, highly urge you, and I'm gushing. Look at me, dude. Look at me. I'm just gushing with joy over this line, man. Trick or treat. Um, holy shit. 120 mil of trick or treat for fifty dollars. That's a killer deal, man. That's a killer deal. That's a fantastic deal. That's like a creamed candy corn. Do you see what I mean? Different, 
different flavorings. You got to have the touch for these kind of flavorings. You know what I mean? It gets better. Uh, the jam line, the jam line was great, man. I tried them all, truffle shuffle and all that, man. Uh, great stuff. High tower, great. It's like a vanilla tobacco. Um, ran right through that. I. That's why it's hard for me to pick a favorite. I mean, really, I do have a favorite, but. I feel like it can stand toe to toe with the other ones in this line. Uh, Berry Dreams, Berry Dreams, a great tank juice. I found like Berry Dreams was was good in a dripper, but I really found it more for me in a tank, in a tank like a Limo Two or something like that. A little single coil, man. Maybe a nickel build, something like uh, I don't know, ten wraps. Not even that. Limo, six wraps, twenty-eight gauge nickel. 8th bit, spiraled, always spiraled, man. I, I like spiral coils in my nickel builds. On here is a dual coil of 28 gauge. Moving on, dude. I'm all talking about builds. <laughs> There's Candy Shop. Yeah, I'll have to look at that. Where are you? Grasshopper, man. It was crazy, and, I, and, and it was a bottle. I was kind of like, well, I'm just going to try it to try it. I didn't have huge high, ho <clears throat> high hopes for it. Cause I'm not a big menthol fan or, or, or spearmint or whatever. Um, yeah, okay. My favorite snowball in New Orleans. Creamy spearmint stuffed snowball with double condensed milk. All right. So do you, do you get where I'm going here with this? A spearmint snowball with double condensed milk? Like, first of all, I don't know where he gets his flavorings. Uh that's pretty wild. I mean, obviously you can get condensed milk, but if you've tried Grasshopper, you've never tried anything like it, and I ran right through the 30 mil. I didn't expect that. Um, I really didn't, and it is, it, it's another great juice. And I'm going to kind of talk about my experiences with these. Speaking of experience, Gelato Shop, right? Gelato Shop was like, you know, it's supposed to be like a gelato, right? Uh, it was inspired by a local Italian pastry shop in New Orleans. This is one of my favorite pistachio gelatos packed into this juice. Okay. You know, if it contains seed or nut flavoring, um, you know, he's going to let you know, uh, which is cool. That juice is way up there. It's right up there with Nectricus. Gelato shop. You can't lose with that one, man. Um... Fall. Now, I want to talk to you about fall, and I'm hoping it's right here and it's not okay. Peanut butter slap. That's a peanut. That's like a roasted peanut butter. It's, it's, it's crazy. But I want to find fall. I don't think fall. No, fall's not. Fall is not um, available. Um, it's got spices to it, right? I think fall, you know? Not autumn. <laughs> it, it's a pumpkin spice. And when you smell it, it smells like a pumpkin pie. I mean, nutmeg. Nutmeg, man. Really? Like, and it's wild. It, it, I think with Coil Vapes, and I got some other reviews on the side. That's pretty cool. I think I saw my dude Devin on there, man. Hell yeah, man. Um, you know, he basically, with, with, the uh, e-liquids in his line are pretty much based off of good times he's had. Maybe a memory of this, you know, and, and he turned it into an e-liquid, and it's great, man. It's great. Banana mode, dude. Oh, my God. Great banana. And when you smell it, it's not like, you know, when sometimes you open a package of banana e-liquid, and it's just banana, like right out of the vape mill. Not like that in this. It's just the right amount. It's not overpowering. Nothing overpowers anything in this line. I think, and I, I really think that's the best way to describe it. A light hand with very, very heavy flavorings. That's the best way to describe this line. And extremely flavorful. Lots of flavor. I feel like you could run through a 30 mil pretty easy and not get sick of any of these. You know what I mean? Um, they all perform pretty well under really low builds, like .08 style. Um, they, they perform pretty well, um, but I, I don't believe these are made for, like, cloud chasing, you know what I mean? Um, 
but great flavor. Getting crazy nuances all the time. I'm getting these crazy nuances out of different stuff all the time. You know what? I'm going to try some candy shop, dude. Let me have a vapor clip. I just saw the camera jump. Has it been jumping? Fuck, man. So, I have it on the Haster here from Cthulhu. You guys heard of this one? They just barely came out with this. And I got a vulcanizer on the bottom. Let's try it, man. Candy shop. Let's look it up. I could have just saw it. Candy shop. And, I, and, and he, told me to, he told me to try it. And, and I haven't gotten to it, man. Because I'm just kind of running through everything else. It's it's wild. Okay, sweet and tart mixed bottle of fruit candy with an ever so slight hint of menthol. Okay. Menthol crystals can form and is normal, which is true. So I'm going to shake it real good here. Strange Vapes has a, look, has a review on it, man. It's awesome, dude. That's cool. So, I mean, you can't just go off my, my review, you know what I mean? I'm just a regular dude, man. Like... There's other people on your strange vapes on here, man. I believe it. I'm pretty sure that was Devin, man. Well shooken up. Oh my god, it smells like sweet tarts. That smells exactly like sweet tarts. I'm gonna get me some of this. And I haven't tried this, you know? Let's get it, man. His bottles, and I'll show you. I thought I brought. I did. I brought one that hasn't been opened. Yeah, the Haster by Cthulhu is a little top air fed design. We're going to review it, man. That and the Cthulhu tank. We'll review the tank, too, man. I hope so. That smells so good. You know, right off the bat, right off the gate, right off the jump, man, you're getting this. Jesus. Let's see it, man. There's the menthol. See, I'm not a big fan of menthol. Not a big fan of menthol. Give me just a second, guys. I'm getting I'm getting menthol right up on the front, right up on the front. But then again, I'm very I'm pretty sensitive to that menthol feel. You know what I mean? Very sensitive to it. It's addicting. Oh, yeah, I'm getting that candy right at the end. My mouth's very cool, very cooled. And right at the end, I'm getting that almost sweet tart candy. That's pretty smart. That's smart. That's good. <laughs> it's an experience. It's an experience. I don't. I'm pretty. Sh I have never had anything like this before. I really haven't. And it's crazy because I'll be vaping this. And I'll move on to something else, and it's almost like I'm still thinking about that. <laughs> Is that bad? That might be bad. Um, that's smart, though, man. Nice clean feel. Candy shop. That's pretty slick, man. Yeah, that's smart. I was going to say the throw hit was lacking a little, but that's it at three. All these all mine are in six, except for that. I think I have a little sample pack of three. Um... Candy Shop, if you love menthol, maybe you were a cool smoker, right? Try Candy Shop, man. That'll get you off for sure. That'll totally get you going, man. Yeah. Hell yeah. You know, and he's got a, quite a few juices that aren't necessarily on here. Uh, it, you know what I mean? Now, this juice I'm about to talk about next. Oh, by the way, giveaway, man. He wants to do a giveaway. Thank you, Dean. Thank you, man. I love giveaways. I love giveaways, man. Giving back to you guys is the shit. It really is. To be able just to hook you guys up with some of this is I'm stoked, man. Somebody's going to be very lucky out there. This is a very special limited release. I'm going to stock up, man. I've gone through 120 mil and 330 mils of this juice. Sweet pea. 
Growing up, we were always excited to see sweet potato crunch as a side for family dinner. Mashed sweet potatoes with brown sugar, cinnamon, and toasted pecans. That's right, we captured it in a bottle. A comfort vape at its finest. Neptune V2 plus build. Who did that? Hey, Tony's on there. What's up, Tony? Honest reviews, man. Shout out to Honest Reviews. That's my dude, man. Tony's my boy, man. I've been watching him since the beginning. Sweet Pea, formerly Sweet Pea Smash, is absolutely, without a doubt, top two e-liquids I've ever had. No question, no doubt about it. I could vape this for the rest of my life just fine. I've been vaping it all day. And I will continue to vape it all night, man. Facts. Got it here on the Vector with a bitchin' mink sleeve to keep from burning me chompers. You know, you can't hang a fang on the Vector, man, without the sleeve. I swear to God, this thing. Uh, tons of emails on the Vector like, dude, Trevor, the Vector's killing me. I cannot get a good vape out of this thing. Please do it. Please. Colossal Clouds made it happen, man. Colossal Clouds made it happen. Got one in my hands, and I think I got it, guys. I haven't seen Tony's review on this yet. I haven't seen anybody's review on this yet. If you want something that's out of the ordinary and just mind-blowingly deliciousness, man. Like, if you love sweet potatoes, this should be a no-brainer, man. This is unreal, okay? I get some nuts. Uh, whether I can chew or not. Not, uh, is that what it is? Brown sugar, yeah, toasted pecans, whether it's pecans or not, I can't really decipher. But I am getting cinnamon, nuts, and a sweet fucking potato, man. It's like I'm at dinner with a sweet potato. It's so good, and it works extremely well in an e-liquid. That's great. Uh, I found that the throw hit on all these at a 6 is very smooth and mellow, which is very nice indeed. Sometimes it can be very harsh. You can tell the bass is very well done. Um, Dean is an absolute master at making e-liquid, and, and this entire line really shows it. It really does. I'm actually really excited. I'm going to go back through and watch these reviews because I'm curious what other people are saying about it. Um, I did promise to show you the bottom. I'm going to show you the bottom line. Uh, but yeah, dude. I mean, it's it's wild. It, it's best well I've ever had. I've ever had the absolute dearest pleasure to use. I'm gushing right now, man. Look at me. And you guys know me. You guys trust me, and you look to me, you know, for advice, man. You guys do. And I'm not naive to that fact. Like I'm not blind to that. I know you guys watch these reviews and not just me but other people to decide whether or not you want to get something it's our duty to lead you in the right direction and maybe find something that you might not have known about these are available at cavapes.com as well and I'll put a link but uh... yeah all the links are all the links are now, now the bottles I want to talk about this is Hightower his bottles are very nice they are childproof for one and they also have a seal on the bottom here. Do you see that? And oh, this one's already popped. Okay, but you know, to to pop that ring takes effort, uh, which is really great. Child proof and all that. The drippers themselves. This is these are really nice bottles. Really nice. Um, never seen anything quite like this. You know what I mean? Yeah, never seen anything quite like that. Fall is out of this world. Look at that. I'm treasuring this juice. Pumpkin pie. To me, that's what it is. I'm not sure exactly the profile of it, but I get pumpkin pie. These these pumpkin spices, and they're... they're... Anytime you mix, you know, spices in with e-liquid, you're playing a very dangerous game. You can go too much or too little, 
and it's it's just it's just mind blowing. As somebody that DIYs like myself, and I make a lot of the e-liquid, man, and I'm learning all the time. I'm learning new tricks and all that. I don't know how he does it. I really don't. But I'm gonna tell you, Nectricus can't lose, man. Um, sweet pea, you cannot lose. If these two flavor profiles fit you, man, I highly urge you to give it a shot. Uh, coupon code TJ Vapes for 20% off. Let's go! Yeah! <laughs> TJ Vapes, 20% off. That's a killer deal, man. I think I want to try that cream corn. I think I'm going to pick a bottle of that one. 50 bucks for 120 This is dialed, man. Like, if you think you've had boutique e liquids, you haven't. This is a boutique e liquid line, for sure. Like when somebody says, this is our premium e-liquid. This is the first time I've ever had a juice and I thought that's a premium e-liquid. You know, I, I don't know what else to say about it, man. I really don't. Uh, thank you to Dean uh, for giving me a shot at these, man. They're great. Uh, it's been great getting to know you, man. It's been great getting to know you and, and be able to try these e-liquids. They are magnificent. <laughs> They're, they're stellar. They're, each one holds their own in their own way, you know what I mean? Giveaway time. How are we going to do the giveaway? That's the one thing I didn't think about, man. Your choice of four 30 mils from the site. Your choice. Right? Me, I would probably get one fall, three sweet peas, man. I don't know. It's up to you, though, dude. It's up to you and your Nick choice. Anything, you just let him know, man. Um, I wonder how we can do this. All right, you need to go. What about his Facebook page? Um, maybe his Facebook page. I just messaged him. How should we give him away? <laughs> like I'm so professional dude it's not even funny people are like fuck dude Trevor reminds me of Quentin Tarantino <laughs> and the real Bob Ross of vaping we all know who the Bob Ross of vaping is right well we got a minute to talk mano y mano dude the real Bob Ross of vaping without a doubt in my mind is Robert the Arm Vapor man shout out to Robert the real Bob Ross dude Look at that guy. He's so crisp, man. He's got that beard, dude. Robert's a G, man. I'm down with Robert for sure. Fantastic. Well, if he doesn't get back to me soon, I'll just have to make one up. I think maybe we could do like a comment down below because I know not everybody does Facebook. Um... Okay. Yeah, you gotta like his Facebook page. Alright? You gotta like his Facebook page. Let me just type it in. Okay, you gotta you gotta like the Facebook page if you have a Facebook account. If you don't have a Facebook account, you need to put hashtag thanks coil vapes down in the comments, man. Alright? Uh, good luck to everybody. Good luck to everybody, man. And, you know, thank you for watching. Thank you so much for watching. It's been really fun. Vaping's been pretty gloomy lately, right? With the whole FDA thing. Let's keep our heads up, man. Let's keep our heads up. Okay? I'm going to be back real soon because I plan on doing this. The Vector. Oh, you'll never focus, dude. Why would you? Maybe we'll try and get a live show in, man. If you have any questions, please feel free to email me at tjvapingreviews at aol.com, man. Or simply comment down below. I'm always around. I try to get back to everybody. If I missed you, let me know, man. I'll get back to you. I try not to leave anybody out, but I know a few of you slipped through the cracks, dude. It's been great. Let's end this, man. In classic form, dude.
Yeah! <laughs> See you guys.